Hello, hello, and hello, everyone. My name is Sharina, and this is Creativity on a Dime. Thank you guys for tuning into my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. You guys, I have so much content to give you for the next few weeks, so if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button below don't forget to click the bell so that way you can receive notifications for whenever i upload new videos trust me you don't want to miss these videos so most people believe that either your bedroom or your kitchen is the most important rooms in your home and for them that is true but for me however i personally believe your entryway is the most important room in your home the reason why I feel that way is because whenever you have guests to come either to your home or to your office, the first thing they see is your entryway. So if your entryway is blah or messy or clutter, it's safe to assume that they're going to think the rest of your home is the same way. So for today's video, I'm going to show you ways on how to not only make your entryway more aesthetically pleasing, but also how you can do it by saving those coins. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, you guys, I ordered a console table and a round mirror from All Modern. So I will do a speed video. for my mirror so we're going to see if that works I have to give it like an hour to get adhesive to the wall I was hoping to be able to cover uh, this utility box since I'm not able to actually cover the full thing I'm going to see about maybe putting some like fake leaves or something underneath the mirror to make it more decorative but for now we're going to work on this side of the wall Excuse the lighting, I need to adjust it. But we're gonna work on this side of the wall, so let's stay tuned for that. Now I'm going to start on my poster gallery wall and I'm using some thumbtacks, these magnet poster frames. I will have these linked in my description below. I got those from Amazon and I developed some pictures from Staples that I pulled offline and these pictures are so, so, so nice. Look at those. Ooh, is it she party? Okay, you guys, so let's go put these on the wall. let's talk about how dope this artwork is oh my goodness look at all these queens yes Woo! get it girl get it get it girl get it so you guys <laughs> I actually thought my wall was way bigger than what it is so that's why little queen over there but that's okay we got pictures all around 
and this gallery wall definitely is a statement maker oh yes total vibe such a mood okay you guys so now we are finishing up we are going to start uh putting our decorations and staging and we're all set for this video take my hand we'll make it somehow we can't miss out Okay, you guys here is the final look i am absolutely in love with how this room looks it is amazing definitely something to talk about when you enter my apartment but i'm just going to go through and kind of let you know what i purchase and wear and things of that nature again all of this will be linked in my description below but these picture here i actually got those off of google i just typed in you know like african queens and princess warriors fearless gods things of that nature and that's where I got these pictures from. Um, the frames, again, I got those from Amazon. This coat hook rack over the door, coat hook rack is from Target. And the reason why I placed that there is because I'm actually changing that coat closet to a utility closet. So that's another video that'll be uploaded this week. Stay tuned for that one. Now, here is the mirror. Hi, excuse my clothing and everything in the background, but I am so in love with this mirror. I wish, however, it was a little bit bigger, but I won't complain. I wanted to kind of hide um, the little switch box back there, but you know, we're just going to act like it's not there. <laughs> Here, I wanted to add some color to the room based off of that first picture we saw. So I added a bowl of limes, a little key dish for my car keys. I also wanted some height and to kind of cover up that um, utility box. Um, I already had this for maybe a year now. I got it from the dollar store and I just added some like little greenery from the dollar store inside of it. Here is a essential oil diffuser and a industrial lamp. I got those from Amazon. Again, all of this will be linked below. These baskets down here, it's a little dark, sorry y'all. These baskets down here, I actually got those from the dollar section at Target. They were probably $5. So here I have my light bulbs for my industrial lamp. And then there, I will be placing our disposable face masks. I should be getting those Tuesday. So all of those will go in there. So that way when we leave out the door, we can grab one. No issue, no problem. I got that planner from Home Goods and those greeneries from Target. Um, this little black rug right here, I got this from Amazon. It needs to be swept a little bit, so I will do that later on. And lastly, this picture frame up here, I actually purchased this from Home Goods as well. It was probably maybe $20. Uh, it was in my bedroom, but since I am redecorating my whole apartment, I wanted to get rid of that from my bedroom, but I did not want to actually get rid of it. So I decided to put it in here since it already has like a boho Aztec tribal vibe to it. I gathered some commander strips and threw some 
throw blankets up for some color as well as you know when my guests come over like my sister she always gets cold so boom there is a blanket for you and you can relax and be cool so again i thank you guys for taking time to review this video please leave me a message below you know if you like the video like it if you aren't subscribed again subscribe make sure you share it with your friends and family and again let's get motivated let's get inspired with each other's pictures and videos and i hope to see you guys soon don't forget i will be uploading probably two more videos this week so i'm so excited okay you guys bye